Have you ever noticed tiny red or purple spots on your skin and wondered what they could be? Are they a rash, an allergic reaction, or something more serious? Today, we're diving deep into the mysterious world of petechiae, those small but potentially significant spots that can reveal a lot about your health. Stick around to uncover what they mean, how to recognize them, and when to seek medical attention. And trust me, you'll want to know this. First, let's understand what petechiae are. Petechiae are tiny round spots that appear on the skin as a result of bleeding. They can be red, purple or brown and are typically less than 2 mm in diameter. These spots are caused by minor bleeding from broken capillary blood vessels, the smallest type of blood vessels in our body. Unlike other types of rashes, petechiae don't turn white when you press on them a key feature that helps in their identification. While petechiae themselves are not usually harmful, they can be a sign of a serious underlying condition that requires medical attention. So, let's dive deeper into what causes these spots to appear. Petechiae can be caused by a variety of factors, ranging from minor to severe. Here are some of the most common causes. Certain infections, both bacterial and viral, can lead to the appearance of petechiae. Meningitis, endocarditis and hepatitis are just a few examples of infections that can cause these spots. In these cases, the body's response to infection can lead to damage of the blood vessels, resulting in petechiae. Injuries or trauma to the skin can also cause petechiae. This is especially common in areas of the body that are subjected to frequent friction, like the wrists or ankles. Medical conditions that affect blood clotting or platelet counts, such as thrombocytopenia or leukemia, can lead to the appearance of petechiae. These conditions often require thorough medical evaluation and treatment. Certain medications particularly those that affect blood clotting like anticoagulants, can increase the risk of petechiae. If you're taking medications and notice these spots, it's important to consult with your doctor. Excessive straining, such as from heavy lifting, intense coughing or vomiting, can sometimes result in petechiae. In these cases, the increased pressure can cause capillaries to break, leading to these small red spots. Identifying petechiae is crucial, especially since they can sometimes be mistaken for other types of rashes or skin conditions. Here are some key characteristics to look out for. Petechiae are small, round, and can be red, purple, or brown. They don't turn white when you press on them, unlike many other rashes. They often appear in clusters and can be found anywhere on the body although they're most common on the lower legs. If you notice these spots, especially if they appear suddenly or are accompanied by other symptoms, it's time to pay attention. If you find petechiae on your skin, a medical professional can help determine the cause. Diagnosis usually starts with a physical examination. Your doctor might also ask about your medical history and any recent activities that could have led to the spots. In addition to the physical exam, several tests can help pinpoint the underlying cause. Blood tests are often used to check for infections, platelet counts and clotting factors. In some cases, imaging studies or a bone marrow biopsy may be necessary, especially if a more serious condition like leukemia is suspected. Treating petechiae focuses on addressing the underlying cause. Here's what you can expect for different scenarios. If petechiae are caused by an infection, antibiotics or antiviral medications may be prescribed to treat the underlying condition. It's important to follow your doctor's instructions carefully to ensure a full recovery. For conditions like thrombocytopenia or leukemia, treatment may involve medications, blood transfusions, or other therapies to manage the disease and improve blood counts. If your petechiae are related to medication, your doctor might adjust your dosage or switch you to a different medication. Never stop or change your medication without consulting your healthcare provider. Maintaining a healthy lifestyle can also help manage and prevent petechiae. 
Eating a balanced diet, staying hydrated, and avoiding excessive strain can all contribute to healthier skin and blood vessels. While petechiae can be harmless, there are times when you should seek immediate medical attention. Here are some red flags to watch out for. If petechiae appear suddenly and spread quickly, it could indicate a serious condition that requires prompt medical care. Other symptoms to be aware of include fever, difficulty breathing, changes in consciousness, or bleeding from other areas. If you experience any of these symptoms, don't hesitate to seek medical help. Prevention is always better than cure. Here are some tips to help you avoid the occurrence of petechiae. Proper hygiene and infection control can help prevent infections that may cause petechiae. Regular medical checkups are essential for monitoring conditions that can lead to these spots. And if you're on medications that affect blood clotting, follow your doctor's advice closely. So, there you have it. Petechiae might be small, but they can tell us a lot about our health. From infections to medical conditions and medications, these tiny spots can have various causes. Identifying them understanding their significance, and knowing when to seek medical attention are all crucial steps in managing your health. If you found this video helpful, make sure to hit the like button and subscribe to our channel for more in-depth health videos. Share this video with your friends and family. You never know who might need this information. And don't forget to leave a comment below if you have any questions or experiences with petechiae. We love hearing from you.